Hi everyone, this is Tracy with Yoga with Tracy. Today's session is gonna be all about our neck and our shoulders. So come join me on the mat. We're gonna incorporate a little bit of yoga and a little bit of Chinese medicine, moving and warming up the meridians of the body. Okay, here we are at our mat. We're gonna start in the middle of our mat with our, with our feet hip width distance apart. Let's slightly put a bend in the knee just to support our lower back. We're gonna roll up the shoulders. Okay, so we never wanna lock our knees ever. Just a slight bend in the knees. And let's just take some nice deep breaths here. In and out. In and out. In and out. Well done. One more time. In and out. Okay, standing in that nice strong Tadasana, slight and bent in the knees. We're going to draw the belly in, lengthen through the crown of our head, take the arms all the way up. Inhale and then exhale. Let's dive down to the toes. Breathe out. Inhale, we're going to come up to that flat back. Exhale down to the toes. Inhale, we're going to press all the way up, drawing the belly in and take our hands to the heart. Breathe out. So we're gonna gently warm up the body. Exhaling out. Inhale the flat back. Exhale to the toes. Inhale, raise your arms all the way up. And exhale, take your hands to the heart. So we're gonna do this a few more times, warming up the body, getting our blood, our chi, our pranayama, our breath, all that nice, great energy, moving it up and down, allowing the breath to be our conductor, okay? Continue breathing in, exhale, breathing out. Inhale to the nice flight, flat back, exhale to the toes. Inhale, pressing all the way up, leading with the chest, exhale, take the hands to the heart. Last one, breathing in, exhale to the toes. Inhale to flat back, Exhale to the toes. Come on all the way up, reach up to the sky. Exhale, take your hands to the heart. Well done. We're gonna take the arms down and roll those shoulders out. So a lot of times we feel a lot of neck and shoulder tension. Now as we get a little more stressed or maybe we're not sleeping enough, that kind of creeps up into our neck and our shoulders. So with gentle movements, with breath, we can help to ease that, okay? So consciously breathing in and out, in and out. Let's do it the other way. Oh, that's a little bit different, okay? So now, a lot of times we always roll the shoulders back, but let's just do this forward. One more time, in and out, and then let's take the arm all the way up and rotate them outward. Okay, now if this is feeling a little tight, we're gonna take our hand to stabilize that shoulder joint and just gently rotate it. Maybe the arm is only coming at this level, that's fine. Your yoga, your practice. So we're gonna do a few more of these. Five, four, three, I'm breathing. Are you? Two, one, we're gonna do the other side. So let's just take notice. How does this side feel versus the other one? I'm gonna take my hand to stabilize my shoulder joint because it is feeling a little achy today. And notice every side of the body is different. So maybe you're a little bit lower on this side. That's okay. Again, your yoga, your practice. Always practicing what's best for you. Okay. Count down, five, four, three, maybe you wanna release it, two, one. Okay, now both together. Woo, five, a lot of cricks and cracks for me, four, three, two, one. And now three, two, one. And still standing in Tadasana, soft knees, Belly drawn in, we're gonna look over to the right, back to center, look over to the left, back to center. Ooh, right ear to right shoulder. 
breath here and maybe sending a little energy out through those left fingertips and release other side sending a little energy through those right fingers now breathing Ooh, this is the grumpy side and release now draw the chin in so it's called a chin tuck right into the body so not just down but into the back of your head and then then now chin to chest lengthening the back of the neck nice breath here okay gently release and how about looking up just gently not too far back holding a nice large florida grapefruit right underneath the chin and the chest opening up drawing the belly in and feeling strong shoulders are back in and out with the breath in and out well done okay we're gonna take the arms up breathe in touch the fingers breathe out come down to the toes now hanging here, I want you to release the back of your neck. Okay, and I want you to nod your head, yes. Yes, I'm gonna help my neck today and my shoulders, releasing all tension. And let's shake the head gently, no, releasing all negative energy, negative self-talk, releasing any pain and tension. No more tension. And let's go back to nodding, yes, yes. I'm gonna help myself here. Great, okay, hands down to the mat. We're gonna come down to the mat and place our knees down onto the mat. It's a tabletop. Always stacking the shoulders right on top of those wrists. Hips stacked on top of the knees. We're gonna sway from side to side, front to back. And then let's melt into child's pose. Okay, so we're gonna reach our fingertips to the front of the mat, lengthening the spine, softening into our hips, taking a nice deep breath here, in and out, opening up the back of the body, the skin in the back of the body, lengthening out again, breathing in, maybe reaching your fingertips a little bit more to the front of the mat. Okay, and let's breathe out. Well done. We're gonna slowly come on up, and open up the chest into a nice cow pose. Inhaling here and exhaling, rounding the back to cat. Okay, again, inhaling to cow, opening up the chest, rolling the shoulders back and down to the tail, and then exhale, rounding the back, belly is drawn in, soft tail, hands are pressed into the earth, exhaling. Okay, one more time, breathing in and exhale, breathing out. Great, come back to tabletop. We're gonna tuck the toes under, push the mat forward in front of you to your first downward dog. Okay, so nice upside down V. This is a nice overall stretch for the whole body. Soften the knees, open up the chest, press into your finger pads into the mat. Take a look toward your fingers. Make sure that you feel like you're really pressed in there. Open up the chest, engage the tops of your arms, and maybe start to straighten out the back of the legs, lifting the backs of your thighs. Take notice of the back of your neck. Is it nice and aligned with your spine? Or are you lifting it up too much or looking back down too much? Just try to have a nice, even spine here, right to the neck. Great, come on up on the tops of the toes. We're gonna walk our feet toward our hands into forward fold. Breathe out. Come on up to flat back, nice tight belly here. Okay, roll the shoulders back and down. This is a very powerful pose. Come down to the toes, breathe out. Inhale, come on all the way up, reach up to the sky, and then take your hands to the heart. We're gonna take our hands to the hips. Step back with your right foot. We're gonna start into warrior two posture, okay? Your front toes are facing the front, your back feet are either 90 degrees or maybe the toes are turned a little bit toward the front of your mat. We're gonna open up the arms nice and parallel to the floor. Your fingertips should be reaching out gently, shoulders are relaxed. 
Take a look at those hips nice and parallel to the floor. Draw the belly in and lengthen up through the crown of the head. Now, if the shoulders are really tight today, you can cheat a little and bend the arms, but still open up the chest and feel very strong here. Opening up, feeling very powerful in the chest. And we're just breathing here. So pressing your feet nicely into the earth. We're gonna breathe in, taking the arms up, straightening the front leg, and breathe out. Again, breathing in and out, sinking. Again, inhale and exhale, softening. Two more, breathing in and out. Last one, inhale and exhale. Now this time I want you to straighten the front leg, grab as though you're holding onto a nice small ball, and I want you to bring it behind you. And as you come forward, I want you to bend your front leg and come on all the way up, inhaling and exhaling. Nice fluid motion through the shoulders, breathing in and out. Inhaling and exhale, swing it right on through. Inhale and exhale, right on through. Two more, in and out. In and out. Now from here, we're going to come all the way back up and sink right back down into Virabhadrasana 2, Warrior 2. Hold it here for three. Remember, you can bend those arms or maybe right here. Two and one. Great. Straighten the front of the leg. Step forward right on up. Reach up to the sky. Dive down to the toes. Breathe out. Inhale, come back to that flat back. Exhale to the toes, hands down to the earth. Step back to downward dog and walk that out a little. Okay, opening up the chest, engaging the tops of the arms, pressing into your finger pads. Awesome, come on up on the tops of the toes. We're gonna come down to the knees onto our mat. Melt back into child's pose. Nice deep breath here. Feel it into the back of the body. In and out through the breath. In and out. Well done. Slowly come on up. We're going to step one, two feet between the hands. Back into forward fold. Press all the way up. Lead with the chest in and then out with the breath. <sighs> hands to the hips. We're going to go to the other side. We're going to step back to the left foot. Warrior two. So now you get to see the back side. We're going to open up the arms. Breathing in. And exhale, breathe out. Remember, we're pressing into the back edge of our back foot. And out, five of these. In and out, feeling strong. Warrior two, in and out. Last two, breathing in and out. Again, in and out. One more, inhale and exhale. Now, remember, we're gonna come on all the way up, grabbing a small, gentle ball, swing it all the way through. Again, breathing in and out. Use your neck and gently gaze up and follow it through. Inhaling and exhaling. In and out. In and out. Last two, inhale, exhale, in and out. Arms come all the way up and sink. Warrior two on the other side. Open up the chest, press into that back leg. Breathing in and out for three, two, one. Release, step forward to the right foot to the front of the mat. Reach all the way up and dive back down to the toes. Breathe out. Okay, let's soften the knees, lift the backs of the thighs right on up, and gently nod your head. Yes, that was something good for my shoulders and my neck. And let's shake no, getting rid of any of that negative energy. No, nope, not going to take it. Great. From here, hands back to the 
mat. I'm gonna step one, two feet, knees back down to the earth, back onto your tabletop. We're gonna open up the chest, breathing into cow, and exhaling, rounding back to cat. Two more, inhaling, and exhaling. Last one, in, and exhale out. Back to Balasana, child's pose, melting those hips. This time, shoulders are gonna melt over those thighs, breathing in and out here. And out. One more breath, in, softening the face, melting the shoulders. Well done. Take your hands to the mat, gently press yourself up, we're gonna slowly come on down to the mat, all the way down to the ground here. Now from here, I'd like you to place your hands down on top of each other, and your head is gonna go right on top of your hands. Okay, and try to have your shoulders in a gentle position. With a nice tight belly, we're gonna breathe in, lift up, and exhale, gently place your left ear down to the mat. Relax, breathe out. Okay, we're gonna articulate our neck here. Inhale, come back up. Exhale, head down. Inhale, back up. Exhale, right ear to right hand. Okay, back up, in. Open up the chest. Exhale, melt, inhale, and exhale. Are you starting to see the pattern? We're going to do this a few more times. Inhaling, opening up the chest, exhale, forehead to hands, inhale, right ear to hands. Last set, breathing in, exhale, down. Inhale, still the belly's drawn in to support our spine and melt left ear. <sighs> Inhale, back to center. Exhale, down. Inhale. And exhale, right ear. Ooh, this is my grumpy side. Inhale, back up, tight belly, lift the chest and melt. <sighs> well done. This time, Place the head down onto the mat and take the palms down to the earth beside you. So your thumbs will be facing out. Your palms are pressed down. With your belly still drawn in, supporting the spine, we're gonna breathe in, come on up, and then release out. Okay, now we're gonna change our breath. Inhaling here, tighten the belly, Press the tops of your feet down to the earth, and then exhale, come on up. Open up the shoulders, breathe. Let's try to straighten our neck out. Nice and neutral to the spine. And release. Please don't hold your breath. Inhale, and exhale, come on up, holding it. Roll those shoulders back, breathing, and release. Do that again. Inhale and exhale. Come on up. Open up the chest and the shoulders, strengthening the back, lengthening our necks, and release. Well done. We're going to take our arms in front of us, lengthening out the spine. Inhale and then exhale. I want you to come on up and do your best Superman, Superwoman posture, lengthening the spine, opening up. And if you want to challenge yourself, maybe you can do a gentle swim. We're gonna count down here for five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna release. <sighs> well done. Take the fingertips and the tops of your shoulders. Push up and back. Let's melt into child's pose again, softening into our hips. Relaxing our shoulders, taking the shoulders and the arms. Arms are behind you and the shoulders are completely relaxed. Take a breath here. In 
and out. <sighs> One more breath in and out. Slowly, hands back down. Gently press yourself up. We're gonna come into a gentle seated position of your choice. So maybe it's like this, or maybe you're down into a cross-legged position. We're gonna take that back, that stance, and start to roll the shoulders out again. In and out. In and out. One more time. In and out. We're gonna take our arms all the way up. Hands to the heart. Again, breathing in and out. Okay, arms are gonna come all the way up. We're gonna gently stretch to the side. Very good, come on back up. Lengthening up and down. Inhale back up and down. All the way back up. And this time when you're down to the side, see if you can lift that arm up and place it behind you. Just giving a little more oomph of gently stretching the side of your neck right down to the side of the body. Okay, we're gonna look down to the bottom hand, softening, relaxing, and breathing. Well done. So you're gonna take that behind, that hand that's behind you, bring it over with a nice tight belly, and come all the way back up, and release. Whoosh, roll the shoulders, three, Two, and one. Ooh, arms all the way up, up. And then we're gonna sway to the other side. Ooh, come on back up, breathing in and out. Inhale and exhale. Last one, in and out. So we're gonna hold it here. We're gonna lift that top arm up. We're gonna place it behind us. And we're gonna just breathe and focus on stretching all the way down from the neck into the hip. Let's look down to the bottom hand, relaxing that bottom shoulder and breathing. Always breathing into the space of most tension. For me, it feels like it's everywhere today. Oh, this is the grumpy side. Yikes. Okay, we're gonna take that hand behind us with a nice tight belly. Come on, all the way up, breathe in. Ooh, breathe out. Let's roll the shoulders. Three, whoosh, two, and one. Okay. From here, if you were crossing your legs, uncross them. If you were sitting um, in a different position, just loosen out your legs so you feel more comfortable. We're evening out the body here. Now from here, we're gonna just rub our hands together. So as some of you know, I've been studying Chinese medicine, passed all my board exams. I'm gonna be a light, I'm a licensed acupuncturist now. And so to add a little bit of Chinese medicine here, we're gonna just activate our chi in our body, which we have. We've warmed up and we've moved the body, moved the neck and the shoulders. We're gonna to start to warm the hands here because I want you to take your hand and just gently press on the yang meridians, the, the outer meridians of the arm, okay? And then I want you to bring it back in on the inside, okay? We're gonna go down again, breathing in and out. We're gonna cross over. We're gonna come onto the out and on the inside. Okay, so we're activating and moving, massaging the yang and the yin part of our chest and our shoulders. Okay, it's nice gentle pressure. So there is not a thing where it's more pain more gain, but 
if you have some nice gentle pressure, it does feel really good. So we're gonna go in and out with the breath. And of course, the slower the better. And I want you to do this consciously. Yang, part of the body, it's the outside and the yin. <sighs> Okay, we're going to do, do this one more repetition. We're going to come all the way across, out and in, last side, out to in. Excellent. Now from here, I want you to gently place a little C cup on your hand and just gently tap yourself on the same areas of the body, all the way across. So again, maybe the harder the better for you, depending on how much pressure you need. Maybe you want to go faster. Okay? So your choice, your practice. But this is really great to now stimulate the chi, the blood, and you're getting things moving so they can help to release. Now, once over, across, and I want you to shake all of that negative tension and stress out of those shoulders. Okay. Whew. Now, breathe in and out. I want you to gently close your eyes and notice how you feel at this moment. Maybe a little tingling, starting to feel the energy in the body. Great. Now, rubbing the hands one more time, warming up the hands so that you can activate it, sending good energy into the palms. I want you to take the hands now, place them to the side and the back of the neck. With your chin gently in, you're going to just breathe. One more time, breathing in, sending warmth, kindness, love, and good energy to that neck. In and out. Well done. Take the hands again, rubbing them. Nice, great, wonderful, beautiful, loving energy. Take a nice deep breath in. And I want you to place it over your eyes. Nice. Deep breath here and out. One more breath in. And on the exhalation, I want you to wash gently. You're kind of caressing your face, the neck, and all the way out, and then just release it. Now, with your hands gently placed down, you're going to take a breath in. One more breath in, noticing how you feel. And out. Well done. We're gonna take our hands to the heart. With our eyes gently closed, I'd like to thank you. Namaste. Feels pretty good now.